<laughs> Here's another ghost. Who's haunting us now? Yuzin! Oh, I remember seeing your body earlier, so I know you can be buried. Don't even make a fuss. Hey, baby water buffalo. Oop. He's gonna be buried there. Rhino Maximus! Oh! Rhinoceros Maximus. Finally gonna be laid to rest. I feel like we're burying all the people who haven't really started haunting us yet, but that might not be entirely true. Elven Caravan. Let's just steal their crap. Who cares? F the dwarves. Oh, he's burying someone right now. But we'll get the traitor in place. Or <clears throat> F the elves, rather. Let's not get that wrong. Tim Smith. So two more coffins to be placed here, and then the rest are going to go into the coffin stockpile. go. Oh, it's going to be assigned to Westo, who's a ghost right now, so that's going to be one less ghost. Good. <laughs> Rhinoceros in the chat. I'm a dwarf in the great glorious of Quill. Well, you were. Now you're just sort of a pile of decaying bones in a coffin. Sorry. Life's tough. Life's tough and the night is dark and full of terrors. As soon as that water buffalo calf was... I don't know if, like, our numbers actually set up okay. I'm worried that, I'm like... No, we have tons of pulse. Uh... Slaughtering of that water buffalo seemed a little aggro. My, um... Oh, right. It only keeps one male around. That's why. Okay. Anyway, is there a trader here? Yeah. Trade. Um... Mark all. Seize. Because what we needed is more stuff. More stuff to stockpile. I didn't even look to see what it was. It was just like, this is mine now. On principle. You know, that's what went wrong with the last fort. The last fort traded with elves that one time. Never again. They show up, we just take all their stuff. Yoink. So that's going to keep all my dwarves busy for the next bajillion years. How's, um... The Damned. Well, the Damned is apparently, like, storing things in stockpiles. The productive child. This is a child with only one leg <clears throat> and is still at work. All right, the Damned, I like you. If you ever grew up to be, like, a full dwarf, I might, I might put you on the throne. We've got a collection of, like, armless, legless leaders. They cause less trouble that way. All right. Coffin's being set up here, so we're just going to enable burial on them. Merchants have embarked on their journey, somewhat more light than... You know, I was thinking about their trip home. I, I just want to make their trip home much easier. I didn't want them to be weighed down by all their goods. It was really being very nice. Alright, who's buried over here? No one yet. Okay. War. Westo. You're the current owner of it, but... There's no... I don't know if there's a body there. Like, you've been assigned to it, but... I don't know what that means. Those engravings get done? Yes, there we go. One. Two. There we are. That should get rid of a couple more ghosts. Including, I think, one of the ghosts that was responsible for killing or delegifying the damned. <clears throat> I 
Rhinoceros Maximus, you don't know what Homestar Runner is? Get ye to the internet. I mean, I can't blame you. At this point, like, Homestar Runner was like the shit something like 10 years ago, in the early days of the internet, when you designed websites for 640 by 480 resolution. I understand. <clears throat> Lowercase row, one day I want to do a DF game where I never dig out underground, stay outdoors, build the trees, make everything out of wood. What are you, some sort of elf? Get out! Oh, uh, Pop Latte has been put to rest. Ao Wong has been put to rest. Oh, that's good. I mean, we still have plenty of problems. We've got a massive pile of corpses outside our door. Tons of people still have to be buried. But it's happening. I guess the dam don't stand ready. Hey, what is that line? Is that from, is that a donut? The dam stand ready? No. Warcraft? The dam stand ready. It's a, it is a line from a game though. Mm-hmm. <laughs> well, my dwarves are mostly happy. No one's like ecstatic or anything like that, but. Well, there's a little bit of downward trend, which is not good. Let's pick someone at random here. How you feeling? Um, view creature. <clears throat> Quite content. Woken by noise. Oh, yeah, all right. Good bedroom, legendary dining room. Haunted by the dead, right? That's a problem. Fine table. Satisfied at work. Admired fine bed. All right. Yeah, they do have bedrooms set up. Minus a few here and there. Almost everyone should have their own bedroom at this point. We can assign a few spares. Yeah, it's not actually building this bed that's just standing there. Actually, both these beds are just standing there, not actually built. So we'll have to fix that later. Right now, we still have way too much stockpiling to do, thanks to all this stuff. Anything good here? We got a bunch of extra wood. Wood, wood, wooden weapons, arrows, food, which is actually pretty good. Some amulets and stuff, who cares about that? We'll sell it later. Put it on the finished good barrel and then we'll sell it. When there's some dwarves that come by, we'll be like, here, I made this, really? It's a thing I did, for real and true. I still need a crap ton of bins. I mean, certainly. How's that job paused? There's no way we have enough stuff in bins. I guess part of it, someone needs to have a job to, yeah, store items in bins and bags and things, and I think that's part of it, too. <clears throat> We've got some extra bins, but things haven't been put in them yet, and then stockpiles have been rearranged. And the other thing I might want to do, actually, yeah, because there's a bunch of crap in the way over here. I'm going to claim everything on this floor, because that might be causing some issues. I mean, yeah, the, the big massive stockpile can cause all kinds of issues. 24 turkeys of just... How many eggs were waiting to be hatched? Oh my god. It's crazy sauce. Oh well. Yeah. Tons of eggs hatched. Oh, I want eggs now. God, I'm hungry. Definitely gonna have to take a... Well, I mean, this is gonna be a shorter stream. We're basically at the two-hour mark, 6 p.m. So, we've been streaming for... Uh, been streaming for four hours so far today. Burial. Burial. There we go. I'm sorry to all the people that are just going to be in the big mass grave over here. But that's life. I should put some doors down. Like that. 
Then we'll have to smooth it. Yeah, so I have bins here that are not being used yet. So yeah, we legitimately have some bins just kicking around. <clears throat> Mass grave nonsense. It's art. Yeah, I thought about laying out the uh, the graves in some sort of pattern. Like the time I did the statue thing outside, but spelled out like Q18. But it seemed a little insensitive to the dead. The real Tashi, Edelrod. Oh, Pop Latte. See, we did have the corpse of Pop Latte. That's kind of annoying. We did this whole engraving for nothing. Sabine King, Redden. All my dead subscribers. As long as they don't cancel the subscription. Boom, 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 boom. So if you subscribe, you two can be immortalized forever in the mass grave, <laughs> gently and delicately. Yeah, we don't want to smooth this stuff out, but it seems really stupid to spend time doing that now. We have more than enough bedrooms. This is probably the only time in the history of all of my dwarf fortresses where I have more bedrooms than dwarves. Or I should say enough bedrooms for all my dwarves, because that never happens. Yes! Migrants! More bodies for the fire, or something. Alright, we're going to let them arrive properly here. And then we'll see who they are, and we'll give them a quick renaming. And then I'll actually uh, bring our uh, stream to the close. We'll just rename them. They're gonna, they walk by here. They walk by this big outdoor, like, body storage depot. All the bloated dwarf corpses. Well, I mean, dwarves are already, always bloated, so that's nothing special. Heyo. Um, -da -da -da, burial. Redux. See, there, we didn't need to engrave you either. Alright, has everyone arrived? A bunch of people still have the new arrival job, which is to be expected. And then probably brought animals as well. They'll so just go to the meeting place, which is the uh, the dining room, and then they'll start working. There we go. Well, let's check. Do they bring any animals that need to be pastured? Oh, oh there's some of them are in cages, right? Vera, yaks, cows, bunnies, cows. Heavy rabbits. Okay. Mm. Therapist. So how many did we get? We got 19! And I think only one of them is a child. Nope, this one's 72. Never mind. I'm misinterpreting what I'm seeing here. Only more like Onget? No. I don't know. That's pretty good. Alright, let's do a quick rename and then we'll uh, we'll wrap this up. We've got Valentel, Sniper GW, The Face, Bungemate, Malkuth. Oh! Redux! Again, I mean, I suppose if there's someone who's going to repeat, Redux would be a very appropriate one. That was ignorant something. Quindos. Another butter dude. Look at that. Anthropos. Mulium. This is too long, so I'm gonna have to shorten this to uh to cool side. Bill's cool side of the pillow. Cook Troll, the real Flobo, Strategizer, Versuvius, Omez, Omevas, One Meves, I don't know, Milling Man, and one more, Bromok. Welcome to the party. Try not to die too quickly. I mean, death is inevitable. Don't worry too much about it. Lots of people with no jobs. Oh, because there's not enough room in the stockpile. Why aren't you storing things in bins? Uh, 
Make a cloth, er, uh, yeah. Cloth stockpile. That's just cloth and clothing, right? It's all the same thing. Make a dedicated one right here. Because there's probably a bunch of that stuff that still needs to be stored. Indeed it does. Start to become activated right away. Oh! We got barrels and bins turned off on this guy! There's the problem. Start using bins! God. Do I really have to tap this way? And then throw in some barrels. Not too many. Okay, hold on. It's way better. Here, I can cancel this thing. Um, EX. Do that. Just... Yeah. Cancel the stockpile. Instead, start using the goddamn bins. There we go! Now they're gonna scoop things up. This is gonna solve everything. Like, why aren't they doing this? Look at them go, they're just picking up boxes, putting stuff in it. Picking up boxes, putting stuff in it. Dragging the boxes somewhere to put things in it. <clears throat> Beautiful. Ah, uh, so much better. Okay. Whew! Meow? Meow! Aww! One of the pet cats has grown into a... Well, one of the pet kittens has grown into a cat. Uh, we've got more coffins, which I now have to... Mark as burial enabled. So the dwarves that show up and have the same names as dwarves that have already died, how are they going to feel about that? I mean, you know, you show up somewhere and it's like, there's a tombstone for John, you're fine. When there's a tombstone for like, Redux, you're like, eh. That's a very common name where I'm from, from the, the southern dwarven lands. It's, you know, it's really common. Lots of places have a south. Ah, oh, Tempe State has been put to rest. I'm actually looking at that tombstone right now. Rot hide, but a dude. See, fire the missiles. Arb, Balamar, and there's hunting sounds, which is fine. Don't mind that one bit. <laughs> Formal clay. Hey guys, why am I dead again? Listen, there was an incident, okay? Any active ghosts left? Sla. Sla. Sla I don't know. Sala is currently a ghost. But other than that, we're fine. Anyway, we're gonna have to bring this to an end. I need to get some FUD in me. Very, very starving. Much noms needed. Uh, but we have a fortress that is sort of vaguely operating in. I didn't know what it was going to be like. I figured there'd be more, like, children pouncing at us out of the darkness. Now, I haven't given up on the idea that there might be more. And certainly ghosts. I mean, this place is going to have a memory. There's some psychic damage that has happened here. Yeah. And I see more people talking about, like, oops, not, not a tomb. Uh, merchandise and stuff like that. I'm like really bad at designs. So if you guys have any di ideas or like phrases or things like that you would like to see on a shirt or something like that, email me. And uh, I gotta try to do that more because like I'm wearing my stuff, right? Like everything I make, <laughs> I end up buying one because I think it's super cool. <clears throat> the wear monitor, Gino. Kukino something has come a large monitor twisted into humanoid form. It is crazed for blood and flesh. Its eyes glow lime. Its black scales are blocky and close set. Now you will know why you fear the dark. God, why is it always a were creature? Eh. Oh, there it is right over there. Yeah, we got to kill this effort, but like stay away while he's in were form. Okay, you're fighting some sort of animal. Giant chinchilla. Let's see. Fight your giant chinchilla. As soon as you go into a humanoid form, we are filling... Anthropos has been found dead. Oh, you were right where the wear form went. Fuck! Fuck! No, it started already! Ah! <laughs> Alright, fight the chinchilla. I'm not, I'm not gonna end with this still here. Or maybe we should. This would be a hell of a cliffhanger. No, one, no one's out there right now, which is good. I think we're gonna have to wait and see what next time brings us, folks. Dun dun dun. To be continued. Let me, uh, okay, these are a bun mark. Do that. That's good. All right. 
There's a, there's a wear monitor outside. We're gonna have to try to murder it as soon as it stops being a wear creature. Are we all armed and stuff? Yeah, everyone's got a ranged weapon. Not everyone's got every piece of armor on, but that's pretty good. Okay. Thank you everyone who came out to uh, both live streams. I hope you enjoyed it. If, uh, if you're new, this is your first time joining us, welcome to the party. It's always kind of crazy. Uh, if you don't follow me on YouTube, that's like where the bulk of my content is. I do YouTube stuff way more than live stream stuff. Uh, we live stream basically every Saturday and normally at noon Eastern time. This was a bit of an exception. Uh, and we usually do nerdy strategy type of stuff. And if you subscribe, your name can be included in various games. And sometimes we do multiplayer stuff. People voted this time to do uh, the Dwarf Fortress. I think Dwarf Fortress was first. Age of Wonders was second. I know Essential also ran a poll that included Endless Legend. And that actually showed up pretty high. But it, then I ran my own poll. So I messed everything up. I'm sorry. Um, but yeah, so that's it. Thanks for watching, everyone. 